Welcome to this overview on the reporting capabilities within Group Reading Assessment and Diagnostic Evaluation Online and Group Mathematics Assessment and Diagnostic Evaluation Online, or also known as GRADE and GMADE Online. First, before we jump into GRADE and GMADE Online reporting, I wanted to provide a little background information on what GRADE and GMADE Online is. GRADE Online and GMADE Online are digitally administered versions of the original GRADE and GMADE, a developmentally based group administered assessment of reading and math given before instruction to drive instruction. The online version assesses students in grade levels 2 through 12. Each assessment level contains multiple sections or subtests, and each subtest contains questions or items designed to measure specific skills that are developmentally appropriate to that level. GRADE and GMADE provide accurate, in-depth, and easy-to-use diagnostic assessment data so that teachers can determine the skills students have mastered and the skills they need to be taught. GRADE and GMADE Online provide two parallel forms at each level to follow progress and monitor growth throughout a student's career. With GRADE and GMADE Online, you receive paperless administration, automated scoring, and reports available within minutes that include information on growth scale values and stay nine descriptors. These reports provide rich data so educators can determine group or individual reading and math placement, analyze reading and math strengths and weaknesses by classroom or individual, identify students who need remedial or enrichment programs, plan classroom instruction, develop individual education plans, quickly get to know transfer students, measure growth from grade to grade, monitor progress during remediation, and more. With GRADE and GMA reports, teachers can quickly and effectively identify students' strengths and weaknesses. Once students have been assessed, analyze the data to plan focus instruction. The various report options give educators the flexibility to view the individual or classroom data they need in easy-to-read formats. There are three different types of reports for both Grade Online and GMADE Online. The Individual Score Summary and Analysis Report, Group Diagnostic Analysis by Type Report, and the Group Score Summary Report. Let's take a closer look at each one. The Individual Score Summary and Analysis Report provides a detailed analysis of a student's individual performance by level and form. It includes a breakdown of student responses by composite and subtest, as well as a detailed diagnostic analysis of a student's mastery of specific reading or math-related skills, including number correct, number possible, number attempted, and percent correct. Included on all reports is a quick descriptor of student's performance, categorized as strength, average, or weakness, which are based on stay nines for the level administered. The composite and subtest summary shows which domains or subtests show strong, average, or weak performance for this student. These performance descriptors are based on stay nine scores of 1 through 9. A score of 1 through 3 translates into a descriptor of weakness. Students receiving an average descriptor fall between a score of 4 and 6, and a strength represents a stay nine score between 7 and 9. In this example, the student's total test score an overall measure of reading ability falls in the average range. The Diagnostic Analysis Summary provides more information about this student's mastery of specific reading related skills. In reading skill domains, for example, word meaning, for which a student's score is below average, the percent correct shown in the Diagnostic Analysis may help identify which specific skills may require further instruction to help improve overall reading ability. This is an example report of the individual score summary and analysis report for GMADE. Again, it shows which domains or subtests show strong, average, or weak performance for a particular student under the composite and subtest summary section, and provides more information about a student's mastery of specific math-related skills under the Diagnostic Analysis Summary section. Again, viewing the specific domain, for example, the math skill domain of operations and computation, a student demonstrating a score that is below average, the percent correct shown in the Diagnostic Analysis 
may help identify which specific skills may require further instruction to help improve overall mathematical ability. The second type of reports provided is the Group Diagnostic Analysis by Type Report. This report provides a breakdown of a group's performance by subtest and skill. This gives a teacher a quick glimpse into the specific types of questions their students have a strength or weakness in. For example, in this grade report, you can see each student's overall ability for the subtest sentence comprehension and how well they did in the specific skills within part of speech and sentence type. In this example for GMAID, you can see the student's overall ability in the subtest concepts and communication and then see how the students did in each skill of comparison, money, numeration, quantity, sequence, and time. The third report provided in Grade and GMAID Online is the Group Score Summary. This group report is intended to give the classroom teacher an overall picture of how the group performed on each subtest. Each student's subtest and total scores are included along with each student's growth scale value and an average growth scale value for the class. The growth scale of values for the total reading and math composites can be used by schools to measure a student's growth across grades. In this example report for grade, the teacher is getting information on each subtest of vocabulary, sentence comprehension, passage comprehension, and listening comprehension, along with the comprehension composite score and total reading composite with the individual student growth scale value and total class growth scale value average score. Please note that the listening comprehension measure is not included in the total reading composite. In this group score summary example report for GMAID, teachers receive scores on each of the subtests of concepts and communication, operations and computation, and process and applications, plus the total math composite score showing individual and the class average growth scale value scores. Grade and GMAID Online makes it easy for teachers to assess students and quickly identify their ability levels and key skill areas to make classroom instruction more effective and tailored to the needs of the students. The online reports allow teachers to analyze students' strengths and weaknesses immediately without wasting valuable instructional time waiting weeks or months for assessment results. The detailed reports and parallel test forms allow teachers to frequently check student growth to ensure instruction and or remediation are effective and students are making appropriate gains. With quick, reliable, and valuable data to drive instruction and student outcomes, let Grade and GMAID Online be your choice of assessments to accurately and thoroughly assess your students to foster success. For more information on Grade and GMAID Online, please visit www.pearsonassessments.com or call 866-842-7428 to speak with a representative.